nuts, 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 stripped. Welcome to Blood, Sweat, and Gears. This is going to be a quick tip. Uh, if you see my other video, you'll see that I've been swapping out the wheel set of, of my 2006 Ford Mustang convertible, and I have a stripped lug nut. So, how are we gonna get this off? I've tried many different things. Let me show you what I tried. I went to the local automotive store, and they didn't have exactly what I was looking for, but they said, hey, we have a lug nut stripped lug nut remover. And I looked at it and I said, this is not going to work. Uh, it has threads inside. I don't know if you can exactly see. It's a reverse thread, so you would thread it on opposite instead of righty tighty lefty loosey. You do the opposite of that. But this basically just continued to strip the, uh, the lug nut. So what I decided to do is uh, take the advice of Scotty Kilmer, and I'm sure many of you are familiar with him. Uh, here it is. This is called the Rocket Socket. And this particular socket has grooves cut inside at an angle. Let's see if you can see that. And as it goes in, uh, it's going to dig into the lug nut and this is tapered so the more you hit it in the more it's it's going to go so i'm going to take that uh, i'm going to put an extension on it half inch extension because it does um i believe it's 19 and 21 millimeters so it's uh, pretty good there and i'm going to take my breaker bar so Let's get on it and hopefully I'm going to break this puppy real quick. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, put it on, and I'm going to take my rubber mallet. I might have to get my two pound, uh, my two pound hammer. Take my breaker bar and let's hope this works. Okay, folks, as you can tell, I am sweating up a storm. It wasn't as easy as I thought. Uh, number one, the chrome cap is what got stripped and just would not come undone. I had to hammer this thing on. I actually stood on my breaker bar in order to get this out, but it did work. I finally got this thing coming out. Now, it should come out easy. I don't know what kind of damage to the threads or to the bolt itself is, but this is how you remove. Ah, that's kind of hot in there. That's how you remove a lug nut. I did put some penetrating oil down into that as well. Uh, and that's probably the reason why you see that before I put lug nuts back on, I will always put penetrating oil or some form of oil on the nut or on the lug itself. A lot of people don't do that. Uh, it's highly recommended. Okay, so that's it. We got that out. And that's the quick tip for the day. Like, subscribe, please leave a comment below. With that, may the Lord richly bless you. Make it a great day right here on Blood, Sweat, and